Hey guys, welcome to our channel. Today I'm going to show you how to install and get RCS message in Android. RCS message is a rich communication service that's made by Google. RCS message is able to have a normal chat service serving as a text messaging. So it's just like a iMessage and hang up. This application allows you to send large files, high resolution photos, bigger videos, and also you can send payments along with delivered and read receipt. Also with the moving bubbles, you can know that somebody is responding. Before we proceed further, do not forget to like and subscribe our channel. Click on bell icon and select all for timely updates. Let's see how to install and use the RCS message. Go to Play Store and install messages if it's not pre-installed in your mobile. Once it's installed, open the message Click on set default SMS and tap on yes. Next step is to turn off the Wi-Fi and use the data package. Now go to the Play Store, scroll down. There is an option available, join the beta version. If it doesn't appear, just close all the tabs and reopen the Play Store. Open the messages again, scroll down. Now you can see join the beta, tap on join. Now it will ask you join beta program, tap on join and close the play store. Next step is to install carrier service from play store. Follow the steps to install those services. Once you done, close the play store and reopen it to install activity launcher. Follow the steps. Open the activity launcher, click OK. Now it's loading. Once the loading is 100% complete, the activity launcher will open a new page. Scroll down this page to find out the messages. We can see two messaging apps here. Choose the messaging app that is having lined icon. Scroll down and choose set RCS flags. Click on set as default. Press yes to choose as a default messaging app. Click OK. Go back to set RCS flag. Choose set RCS flags again. Here you have to set ACS URL and OTP pattern. For ACS URL, choose the third option. Click on it. For OTP pattern, there is one option. Choose that and click apply. For our convenience, we can move this app to home screen. Next is to go to mobile settings. Scroll down, choose apps and choose messages, choose storage, clear cache, go back and full stop. Follow the same steps and choose carrier service. Storage, clear cache, and go back. Finally, the installation part is done. Now we can restart our mobile. Tap on restart, wait for reboot. Now we can choose Android messages. Make sure the two messages option is available. One is from Samsung and another one from Google. Choose the Android one. Now you can see chat messages which means your RCS message is already activated. This application will work only if the opposite person has the RCS enabled. Otherwise, it will work as a regular messaging app. It will work in any Android devices. You can even send the voice messages. Now you can send picture, video, location, etc. Here you can see the bouncing bubbles, which means the opposite person is responding. As I told you earlier, this application shows the status of the messages as sending, delivered or read. I can understand the procedure is a bit longer. 
Hopefully in future it will be directly available in the Play Store. Hope this video was informative. Do not forget like and subscribe our channel.